few weeks ago, police told us they would start cracking down on dangerous driving and speed racing on the streets. And tonight, there's evidence they are. A Memphis man is facing serious charges after a special patrol caught him allegedly drag racing. Investigators say Jeremiah Taylor was racing down a busy street and ran from officers when they tried to stop him. Taylor is in jail at 201 Poplar tonight. Our WRG's Andrew Allison is back to tell us how police finally caught up with Taylor. Police had Taylor in custody within a few minutes, and as it turns out, this was all part of a special operation to clean up the streets. Accused of drag racing down a busy Memphis street, Jeremiah Taylor isn't moving very fast tonight, confined to his jail cell at 201 Poplar. It's getting ridiculous out here. According to investigators, police caught him racing down Winchester near Ridgeway last night. Those officers, part of a special team conducting Operation Spring Cleaning, an effort to make the streets safer by putting more officers in certain areas. Welcome news to concerned residents. It's not safe because we have kids, not only just kids out here, we have older people, even young people, innocent people getting killed with the drag racing stuff. So they need to stop it. Investigators say officers tried to pull Taylor over, but he just kept going. They lost him for a few minutes, then spotted his car close to a nearby church where Taylor allegedly took off on foot because he ran out of gas. You say it. Officers quickly chased him down and arrested him, seizing two guns, a scale, a bag of marijuana, and nearly $4,000 in cash. Investigators say they also found evidence on Taylor's phone that he was selling drugs. His life was over with now. And they didn't get to arrest him. I don't feel sorry for him at all. The 23-year-old facing a long list of charges, including reckless driving, evading arrest, and possession of a controlled substance with intent to sell. It's all within the home. The parents need to start doing a little more with their kids. And she's glad police appear to be doing more with Operation Spring Cleaning. So they can continue to wrap this stuff up off these streets because we already losing our kids, our youth every day. I know that it's, it's going to take a process. Taylor has a long process ahead of him. He'll continue to answer for his charges when he faces a judge tomorrow. In downtown Memphis, Andrew Ellison, WRG News, Channel 3.